my heart done dropped in my stomach a couple times when I done seen my size gone or the price is so low and I, I don't have my size available. So I don't want that to happen to y'all. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Sierra and on my channel, I like to talk everything fashion. In today's video, I decided to come at you guys with my Essence sale hacks, how I shop on Essence. I have been shopping with Essence for about four years now, you guys. I absolutely love, love, love their sale. They have the best designer sale ever I have ever seen, which is why I'm just so loyal to them. Like, even when they don't have a sale, like, they're just the best. Their customer service, everything phenomenal. Because I have been shopping on Essence so long, you guys, I know how their sale works. I know, you know, that they tend to drop the prices as weeks go on. And I know what items I need to buy right away and items that I can wait on, so to speak. So I decided to come up with a couple tips, hacks that you guys can also follow to get the best deals for your money. So starting off with the first tip I have you guys is to buy sought after brands first, okay? We all know that with the Essence sale that week one is 20% off, week two 30% off, 40% off, 50, you know, so on and so forth. So for items like Rick Owens shoes, you know, Margiela tabbies, you kind of don't want to wait on like week three or four because nine times out of ten your size is going to be so out. Okay, so for instance, with my Rick Owens Ramon sneakers, I got these about two and a half, three years ago now, and I purchased them during the Essence sale, during their summer sale, and they were $584. Don't ask me how I remember the exact price. Okay, I just do. I had one of these shoes for a very, very long time, so I remember every detail. So yeah, I got these for more than half off, you guys, because if you look these up now, the Rick Owens mainline Ramones, they're like... $1,400 some places or some places you can get them for like a thousand but girl who paying that not me so when I see these for 500 something dollars you guys I was like girl snag luckily I did not wait on them you guys because what I noticed is as soon as I got them arrived and you know went crazy I noticed that they had dropped in price girl I know. but check the size my size was unavailable so had I have waited for like week two or three, I wouldn't have my Ramones, period. So do not wait for the tabbies. Do not wait for the Rick Owens sneakers. Get them right away. Okay? I know that seeing them lower in the future may hurt a little bit, but it also will hurt if you wait and then your size not available and then you gotta pay full price. Like, no. Next tip, you guys, is to hold off on things like jewelry or things that are less sought after. So, for instance, I had my eye on this Isabel Morant necklace. I'll pop up a picture right here. When this necklace went on sale, you guys, I noticed that first time I seen it, it was like 20% off. And then it had got all the way down to like 80 something dollars. Now, if you look at the original price, with the original price is like 250 jewelry is not at the top of everyone's list. So that's something that I see on Essence that literally stays through the end of the sale. So girl, wait on that. For instance, like Surface, that brand that I reviewed yesterday, I'll actually have that video linked down below if you haven't seen it already. But brands like that, people don't really know about, you know? It's not like Off-White or it's not like Margiela. So you can count on that to still be there in the later weeks. So we can wait on that. Thirdly, make sure you have your wish list ready, period. That is the main thing, you guys. If you go on my Essence wish list, everything is ready to be purchased because you don't want to be scrambling at the last minute, like, shit, where's those shoes that I wanted? Like, where's that shirt? Because I don't know about you guys, but sometimes, like, if you don't screenshot an item or if you don't put it in your wish list or in your basket, when you go back to websites sometimes, it'd be like the item just disappeared. And I'm like, so to avoid all of that, y'all, have your wish list ready, okay? So that you can just go purchase, put in car, and then receive it in two days. Cause you know Essence shipping, okay, it's like literally no more than a week, typically. I guess it depends on where you stay too, but that's one thing why I like Essence, you guys, is because I am an impatient person and I really, really want my things like right away and they don't lag, okay? As soon as you buy it, they be packing it up and sending it out by the end of the night, period. So be ready, cause they ready. Next tip is to screenshot everything that you buy, okay? Screenshot everything that you buy. The mistake that I made with my Ramon sneakers and I didn't know then is that I should have screenshotted the price because then I could have called Essence and be like, yo, this dropped in price, can I get some of my money back, period. 
if you buy your tabby boots right or your tabby ballerina flats or whatever and you buy them for you know 20 percent off but then you notice like a week later that not a 40 percent off and you like damn that's like through two three hundred dollars like i have in my pocket if you have your screenshot of the item that you buy you guys with the price that you bought it at essence will then look at that price because you got to email them that screenshot and then they'll look at it and they'll be like okay cool we feel you we get you let me get your money back and that's one thing that i'm i think a lot of brands do because i've called around a couple places and i've also worked <laughs> at a couple retail spots so i know that companies tend to honor um discounts after you purchase of course it's after a certain day so you can't be coming like two months later and be like oh i seen these shoes uh 30 percent off now i bought them like two months ago no sis that ain't gonna work i believe if you purchase them within like 14 days and the price goes lower within those days then they will reimburse you the difference so that is a really really good good tip to remember screenshot everything because i've made the mistake so for the last and final hack or tip that I have for you guys is to buy timeless classic pieces. So again, that's your Margillas, your Rick Owens, your Tom Browns, things of the sort. For one, those are again pieces that are going to leave the quickest, you guys. The quickest, okay? I've seen it happen. My, my heart done dropped in my stomach a couple times when I done seen my size gone or the price is so low and I, I don't have my size available. So I don't want that to happen to y'all. So buy the pieces that you know are pieces that will last you for years and won't go out of style and aren't super trendy staples is also a good thing to buy you guys during the sale because those are the pieces that you know are going to be full price after the sale so it's best to buy those types of things on sale you know and yeah those are all of the hacks and tips that i have for you guys if i miss anything if it's other tips or hacks that you guys could give me or give the youtube community let me know let us know in the comments down below i'd really really be interested in knowing you guys hacks thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video